Hey there, TRW crew, Matt Vassalo here with TheRhinestoneWorld.com. So the other day I made an awesome video showing you how to use a heat transfer vinyl on a baseball. So I did this custom baseball here. It says Sting Select. It has the little logo on it as well. Pretty awesome using our color print easy and a rolling Versacam. Now I'm going to show you how to do something similar just using some basic easy weed heat transfer vinyl. So you can see with this cut right here, it's a very small cut. Now I did use this with our TRW Design Wizard software. We have a special overcut feature in the software for small text. We also have it to where it can split the text to make your easy weeding as well. So it's going to help you with very, very small letters like this. We also used a Roland GS24 to cut this small text with the 45 degree blade. So let me show you how easy this is to press onto the baseball with some of our TRW heat tape. All right, so we're over here at the press. As you can see, I'm just using a 16 by 20 Hotronics Auto Clam heat press. Nothing special, no types of special platens or anything. So this is actually a synthetic leather baseball. The one I used here was a real leather official Major League Baseball. So it doesn't matter what type of ball you use when you're doing something like this. So first thing I'm gonna do is I wanna get pretty awesome here we got our first home run and the player's name. So pretty cool, pretty unique to be able to do. You can do a state championship, anything like that. Baseball, softball, football, soccer, anything you want. So we're going to do this. First thing I can do is grab some of my heat tape here. Now my heat tape, what that's going to do is that's going to help the design stay straight on the baseball as I'm pressing it, okay? So I got my heat tape here. I'm going to do it. Let's go right along the side this way. So all I'm going to do is line this up perfectly. That's looking great there. Right across. And you can see my heat tape's got that down. Then all I'm going to do is just roll it right across the top of the heat press. So all I'm doing is rolling the text and rolling this name right across the top of the heat press right onto the platen. I'm providing my own pressure. All right, so once we feel like it might be on there pretty good, let's just go ahead and grab the edge of our heat tape here. And we can peel this off. And just be careful when you're peeling it off that everything is staying there nicely. And that's looking beautiful there. Okay. So, got a couple little areas where if we just rub it, it'll make it go away with the marking. And there you go. First home run and the player's name. Now let's get some other things on there. We got the score of the game right here. So a 12-3 game. And then we also have, it was 210 feet on field six and the date, okay? So let's go ahead and get the date and the feet on there real quick. Now, a lot of different ideas you can do with stuff like this. You can do it for a save the date for a wedding. You can do it for a state championship, first no hitter, first hit. Um, someone that was drafted into the major leagues or they make it to college or make a high school team, all different types of things you guys can do, all right? So let's go ahead and want to make sure they line up. So it says official league right here. So it says official league right here. All I'm going to do is line this up perfectly. That's looking good there. And I'm going to get a little, couple little pieces of tape to go across the top right here on this one too. Right there. And right there, just to hold down my edges, okay? So that's looking good. Let's go ahead and get this pressed on here. Now, if you use just basic sign vinyl on something like this, it is going to come off, okay? So that's why you want to use this heat transfer vinyl like this because it's actually pressing it to the baseball. The sign vinyl will definitely come off. We've actually thrown the baseballs around 
obviously not something you're going to make and use in a game or use in practices. It's for display, but it is on there good. All right, so let's go ahead and make sure we're good on this one. Start peeling this off. Everything's looking nice. Boom. There we go. 210 feet. February 26, 2016 on field six. And we got one more to do. Let's do this one real quick. We got the score of the game. We need to let everybody know that we won the game as well. So we're going to match it up so they're all right side up, of course. And let's drop this on there. Again, a little bit folded at the top, so I want to make sure that that's down there good. And the number 12 there. You can see the tape's real nice because you can actually see through the tape, so you can actually see your design still. Definitely helps a lot when you're doing this. All right, so let's go ahead and get this pressed here. All right, got that part of it done. Let's peel our heat tape off here again. And now remember, this is not regular tape. This is actual heat tape that's made to withstand the heat of the heat press, okay? And there we go. So we got our Sting, number, Sting 12 Vipers 3. First home run, Jackson Vassallo. 210 feet, field six, on February 26, 2016. All right, guys, so I hope this video helped you out. I hope it sparked some new ideas for your business to make some money. Just to give you an idea, on this baseball right here, having first home run, their custom name, having the score of the game, and then also having the, the feet of the home run, what field it was on, and the actual date on it, everything, they would bring the actual home run ball to us, okay, or just bring a regular ball to us, and then we would charge $25 to put all of this on there. It's a pretty big moment, okay, pretty big moment, and they will pay $25 for something like this that they can display because they're very proud of their son or daughter or whoever it was. So it's not just baseball, all different types of sports, anything. We customize everything here at the Rhinestone World. So check out our YouTube channel. We have over 1,500 tutorial videos to help your business. And if you have any questions, make sure to give us a call. Number is 941-755-1696. This is Matt with the Rhinestoneworld.com. You guys all have a great day.